Alright guys, I want to see everyone on the feet wherever you are! It's time for Rock Kids Live! Let's drop that! All right, Jonathan, do you want to come down here and lead us in our warm-up? All right, you guys know what we're just about to do. Are you guys ready at home? Let's do the monkey. All right, let's pick those bananas. Let's go. Monkey. Stretch monkey. it out. Monkey. All right, this way, go. To the side. Everybody down, go. My team. Heading over to the studio. Okay. Oh, man. That Ooh. always takes it out of me, that does. Woo. Yeah. Feeling good. Wow. Well, it's so good of you guys to join us today for another Rock Kids Live. We have got an awesome, awesome episode lined up for you guys today. I know you're going to love some of our segments. We've had a lot of fun. But before we do anything, I think it's time for some Ask the Team. In season two of Rock Kids Live, we've not had any questions for you, you yet, have si, not. And no. I haven't asked any either. So I have got some questions for you All to right. kick off. Can we have the timer on the screen, please? Two minutes starting now. What would be the first thing you'd do if you became prime minister? Ooh. Oh. I would make Rock Kids great again. <laughs> make Rock Kids great again. The light one not already great. Who is your hero? My hero. Who is your hero? Is uh, Tom Morello, guitarist for Rage Against the Machine. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, what is your biggest fear? What is biggest your biggest fear? fear. Uh, this is quite a morbid one, but probably like losing loved ones. Or upsetting your wife. That's, yeah, Something that's come like to that. close second. <laughs> what makes you angry? Ooh, um, oh, I don't know. A lot of things make you angry. Itchy beard. Itchy beard, maybe, yeah. <laughs> that's it for you. What is your favourite thing about Rock Kids? Favourite, favourite thing, thing about, about Rock Kids? kids? Uh, seeing kids being impacted by our work, probably, and singing the songs with them and seeing them 
through the week doing that. Awesome. Which country would you most like to visit that you've never been to? Oh, I'd like to go to Japan. That's my Japan. wife's dream to cool. go. And I was cool like, yeah, that sounds cool. Yeah. Are you a mummy's boy or a daddy's boy? Mm, daddy's boy, probably. Daddy's boy. Take no offense, mum. Uh, who is better, Joe Wicks or Bo Hicks? I'd say Bo Hicks. Bo Hicks? Easily. Maybe we'll see some of him later on. So many moods. Would you rather get bitten by a snake or mauled by a tiger? Um, <laughs> the snake. <laughs> Who would win in a fight between Bo Hicks and Betty the Bog Roll? Betty. <laughs> Betty. Who would win in a fight between Jonathan and Betty the Bog Roll? <laughs> um, I'd say... Betty again. Okay. What instrument would you most like to learn? Oh, I'd really like play? to learn how to play the piano properly. The pia, pia, piano. And we are out of time. That is it for Ask the Team. Now, Sai, why don't you tell us what we've got coming up next? All right. So, um, there's been a video circulating on the internet that has made people a little bit upset. And it's come from America, right? And uh, we thought that we would watch this video as the Rockets team, myself, Cam and John, we would watch this video together and react to it. But that's all we know. All we know is that some people are a bit upset by this video and that it's from that's, America. That's, that's all literally we all we know. So here's a clip of us reacting to that video. So we're going we're gonna to react to this video because someone's yep. asked us to. We don't really know what we're watching. Apparently this is how you I, make tea. I heard a lot of people got angry about this. I'm not a tea maker. I don't like tea, so I might not get as offended, but oh, okay. I know, Sai, you like a good cup, I like of, tea. A good cup of tea. I, 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 I know a lot of honest. people are quite offended by this. Play, play it, play it, play it. Okay. Hey guys, so I got a lot of questions after my last video, and everyone wanted to see me make hot tea or British tea. Hot so today tea. we are going to. Who gonna calls make it hot tea? tea. <laughs> so fill our mug uh, with water. Hang on, hang on, hang on, <laughs> hang on. Can hang we on. stop it there? Why is she filling the mug up from the tap? Where does a microwave? I've made Why a... does the microwave open like that? Is the microwave meant to open like that? <laughs> All right, have we got anyone who tunes in from America? Do they have kettles in America? Is a serious My question? mind is blown already. Why, why would you not just use a kettle? Okay. Even the mug looks kind of silly. Okay, so they're heating the water. Let's see what else happens. Not a good start. Here we go. Set it for a minute. Pour the milk in. Hang, the hang milk, on, hang on, stop it there, stop it there. The milk in. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> so the water goes in from a tap. They heat it for one minute, which isn't even a lot of mug of water. Where's the tea bag in all this? Because all they got is water and milk. This is just offensive to the cows so far. Because just I have no words. I'm not ready for the next bit. Heating the mug up in the microwave and then pouring the milk in. I'll play the next bit, I'll play the next bit. Drop your tea bag in. <laughs> Add the sugar. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I sugar. Sugar. Look how full the mug is. <laughs> she's literally filled it to the top. I feel sorry for this girl because she's just doing as she's told from the older woman. It doesn't even have color. So it, it's like, it just looks like milk. So there's actually a tea bag in there, and then she's literally pouring a whole bag of sugar. Okay, so what I've learned so far is Americans don't have kettles, they don't have spoons. <laughs> Drop two sugars, please. I'll just pour it in and guess. I know there's some people, right, because I've seen it done, who put the milk in before they take the tea bag out. And I do that. Oh. When I make tea for you, though, you and you do. like it, yeah, so yeah, should yeah, we yeah. vote him off, Rock yeah, Kids? Yeah. Give it a little Oh, start. now the spoon comes. <laughs> They've discovered spoons. <laughs> That's how you make hot tea. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's not. <laughs> they discovered it. spoons in 2020, though. No, it's, it's the same colour as the inside of the cup. Look and that's how you make hot tea. Her daughter's face is like, please don't make me drink this, Mum. <laughs> <laughs> please, no. Rock Kids has to do something about this. Should we go and make some tea? We need to have an episode where we make some tea. I can see why people got angry there. It's annoying me that she's smiling. I, I've had enough. I'm not staying. I'm not watching <laughs> that again. Bye, Karen. All right. We hope you enjoyed that. We... <laughs> We did enjoy we, it. We enjoyed it, but also didn't enjoy it because it kind of made me furious that Americans make tea like that. Shall, shall we teach people how to make tea? Would you guys like to see that? We could teach you how to make tea on yeah, another Rockets we'll Live we'll episode. But next, we have got something real, real special coming up for you guys. Let's head up to the stage. You guys know what time it is. Jonathan. All right. All 
alright when I say what time is it? You guys shout battle time. What time is it? Battle time. What time is it? Battle time. I said what time is it? Battle time. Alright. is the drink roulette battle. It's gonna be Cameron versus Jonathan. We're gonna have a series of drinks labeled A and B. There's gonna be three rounds and they're gonna decide between them which one they wanna drink. Now, one of the drinks is a normal drink that you might enjoy. And the other drink is a concoction that I made. Okay, so who is gonna be a and who's going to be B? Have a quick discussion. I think Cameron, I'm going to let you decide first. A or B to drink first? B. B. Okay, so Cameron's gone for B. All right, so we've got your A and B. Okay, so after three, you're going to have a sip and we're going to see what you got. You ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh, that's all right, actually. Okay, okay. I don't know so, what it is, but it's all right. All right, put it down, put it down. It might not be so bad. I might have the rest of that. But if someone has the concoction, then they lost the round. All right, put it down on the table. <laughs> okay, let's take off the label. Let's see what you had. Oh, it was Luke. Luke's, eh? yeah, <laughs> Milk no, and no, orange. Like... Milk and orange, you uh, guys. Milk and I orange. Was like, that tastes like a bit like Luke's, eh? but it's got a bit that, more That's all concoction. right, though, because milk's nice. Milk, good. Orange juice, good. Both good. Yeah, maybe not together, though. Okay, A and B again, guys. Jonathan. Choose your fate. Your call. B. B. Okay, so at the moment it's 1 0 to Cameron. Pick up your drinks, have a little go. Here we go. Three, two, one, drink. <laughs> oh, what is that? All right, so it looks like. <laughs> Mine's actually nice. Is, is mine Vimto? Mine's really nice. Yeah, you have reveal. Please make a reveal. Cameron's getting lucky here again. Fizzy Vimto, hey. soy sauce and coffee. Soy sauce. <laughs> soy sauce and coffee. So does that mean does that mean I've won? Oh well, if I've won, I don't want to drink something that could be bad. So now gonna... for the entertainment of you guys, Cameron is in fact the winner. But we're going to do it one more time, and you guys can do a socially distanced rock paper scissors to see who decides. All right, so here one, we go again. One, two, three. Yeah. Oh, okay. No. A or B, Cameron? I'm going to go A. It's a. Closest. Okay, Jonathan, could you get a hat trick here? All right, grab hold. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> That's quite nice. What is it? What the heck? What? How has he done this? What is He's it? picked the right one. Every... Jonathan's going back for more. I don't understand. Oh, oh that's foul. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, reveal. What was A? And what was B? So we had Fanta, Fanta Twist. Fanta Fruit Twist. And vinegar. vinegar and cocoa powder. Vinegar and hot chocolate, oh. cocoa powder. That means that somehow Cameron has won three points to nil is the winner of Battle oh. Time! Yeah, all right, no one likes a gloater. Let's head back to the studio. I feel so sick. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty good after that. You know, are you not feeling so well, Jonathan? Why might that be? It was definitely the last <laughs> one. That, what was it? Vinit soya or, oh, I don't even know what it was. The salty I think. one, soy sauce. And hot chocolate. Wow. It was just, yeah. Oh. That's not something I will be trying anytime soon. And make sure you don't try that at home either, because that could be pretty disgusting. But we're almost at the end of today's Rock Kids Live episode. Jonathan, I'm just gonna have to take over now because Jonathan is asleep or something. He's feeling pretty rough. It's coming up. Bless him. Are you gonna go and throw up? It's a bit like the chicken nugget challenge. If you're gonna challenge. throw up, get out my studio, <laughs> go away. Okay. All right, thank you so much guys uh, for tuning in 
uh, today. Don't forget to like uh, the video and subscribe. Leave a comment, maybe give us some suggestions of other crazy things we can do for battle time, other reaction videos we can do and stuff like that. But it's been so good of you to join us. But now we're gonna finish off with something really special yet again. Now this was a real hit the last time we invited this person on to Rock Kids Live. Some say that he holds the world record for the 100 meter sprint, the 200 meter sprint, and the four and 800 meter sprints. And some say that he does not. But it is one man, the workout guru himself. It's Bo Hicks. Let's see you kicking those legs, guys, like this. Go round your living room. I'm Bo Hicks, it's time for another Bo Hicks workout. You guys know what's coming. We're gonna do a few different exercises. Jonathan and Si are gonna join me. Are you guys ready? All right, let's go. I want you to pretend that you really need the toilet. Oh, your bladder's full. You're going up the stairs this way. You turn around, you go down the hallway. You're going, you need the toilet. You really need a wee and sit down. And the relief is palpable. All right, okay, do some stretches. You all know what backstroke is. You've all been in a swimming pool, but what I want you to do is a different kind of backstroke. Put your hands in the air and your hands on your back and just give yourself a little stroke. There we go. That's a bit of backstroke, okay. Next one, we're gonna do a bit of Dancing Queen. Let's see you dancing. I like to call this one the Theresa May. Here we go. You boys are looking good. You're looking good at home as well, the Theresa May. All right, let's do some stretches. Stretch your eyes, just like Dominic Cowens. Stretch them wide, all right, that's a stretch done. All right, now we're gonna climb the Great Wall of China. Let's see you climbing that wall. Climb the Great Wall of China. Whew. The wall's pretty big, so we won't go the whole way. Whew. My hair's going everywhere again. Here we go. All right, stretch your stretch that way. And go the other way. All right, and back to the middle. Stretch that way. And go the other way. All right, lovely. All right, we're almost done, folks. Here we go. I want you to pretend to be a giant lobster with your things like this. I don't know what they're even called. Or a crab. Something like this. You're going side to side. It's your social distance. Crab and lobster dodging, just in case you ever find yourself in the water, because you still need to social distance, even if you're in the sea in Brian. It does not matter. Oh, we're feeling good as your heart racing. Let's finish off with some stretches. Stretch up to the ceiling. Grab the beach ball and slam it down. Oh, lovely. Stretch that way and just keep going. And then stretch the other way, and keep going that way. And stretch backwards, stretch forwards. Oh, we're feeling good today, boys and girls. All right, that is about it from me, Bo Hicks. It's been a pleasure. Thank you, Si. Thank you, Jonathan. Thank you, Cameron, in the studio. It's been wonderful. Let's just finish off with some leg kicks. We'll see you again soon. Goodbye.